Here's my, here's my only non volleyball over the net skill. I think that when you're dealing with younger kids, the biggest problem you're going to have in serving, and it shows up sometimes in hitting and any contact, is this idea of the contact point. Hitting the ball, just putting your hand on the ball and actually hitting it, because for them to develop the advanced skill of the touch on the ball and how much pressure is needed, they're going to need to work on making contact. So the first thing that I would say is, I'm going to say a phrase, I want you to repeat it back to me. So really simple, everybody repeat after me. Say middle of the hand to the middle of the ball. Middle of the hand to the middle of the ball. So we ask them to do that. And then what I'm going to say is, I want you to, and I'm demonstrating as a lefty. Are you a righty? Good, so she's a lefty. I would say, you're going to hold the ball in your non-hitting hand with your, or in this case, it'd be right hand, right hip. You're going to bring your hand up, and you're going to hit the ball into the ground. And when you make contact with the ball, you're going to hit the ball and rebound your hand away from the ball. Okay? The purpose for this is to help loosen up the shoulder. A lot of times, and you'll see this, players will strike this ball, and they're going to come straight through the ball, and they lock all the muscles in the shoulder. So what we want is to get them to work on the contact point as well as relaxing the shoulder and getting the whole arm to work. So again, I'd be holding the ball in front of my hip, bring my hand up, and i just hit the ball into the ground. And if they do it the right way, the ball is going to shoot straight up. So and it's one person, one ball, grab a ball, and I'd say move out on the court anywhere you want to go because now this is the part where they get to practice and I'm going to watch. And I would say again, you hold the ball in front of your hip, okay, right in front of the hip, hand up, and what you're going to do is hit the ball to the ground and rebound your hand away from the ball. So just do that. Okay, so what did everybody just do, or almost everybody, we got one person doing it right. Okay, so I would go again. Rebound your hand away from the ball after contact. So it would be looking like this. Okay, so go. And I let them practice that, okay? Because I, I, wanna, I wanna see them, because for guys, the difference between serve for guys and serve for, I think, for girls or men and women is guys are always thinking power element. Harder is better. And, and then people would say, well, you're not gonna get all that power from young girls. Well, we don't need all that because I think that timing creates power. And if you can get everybody to understand that, that timing will create power, Timing and speed will create power. Then you got the right, you got the right element for serve. Okay. So what do we got? All right. So as we're looking at Hallie, Hallie's holding the ball a little bit too high. So again, we would want to go around her as they're practicing and remind them to hold this ball right in front of the hip. Bring the hand straight up. Hit the ball to the ground and rebound your hand away from the ball. And the only reason I'm doing this is I'm getting them. Well, two. I'm getting them to warm up the hitting shoulder. And I'm still working on this contact point because you're going to see they're going to do, some are going to do this. And then what do you got? You got 20 people running around the court chasing volleyballs. So the key here is to keep on qualifying this contact so that they're all doing this. So they're all within this space. Once I've got that going, now I can go on to the next thing.